Good morning, parents. This is Mrs. Albin, the school counselor at Rensselaer Central Middle School, here to give you some information for how you can log in to access your child's I-STEP scores and how you can request a rescore. A rescore is when you request that CTV have the open-ended items that your child submitted reevaluated by somebody else to see if they could possibly have earned more points. The only time that you can do this is during the week of November 9th to November 13th. After November 13th, you will no longer be able to request a rescore. Only a parent can request a rescore. You should have received a letter that looks like this. It has the web address that you will need to access the Indiana Parent Network. You will need to go there to log in to access your child's scores. You have the invitation code here which you will use to create an account if you've never created an account before. If you're a returning user, you can use your login and password that you created in 2014 and click the claim new invitation code and enter your invitation code. You have directions here. The web address you need to go to is indiana.ctb.com. When you go there, it will look like this. You will need to click on the Indiana Parent Network here on the right, which will take you to a new screen that looks like this. If you have your username and password, you can go ahead and put them in there. If you forgot them, you can click on these forgot username or forgot password to get some assistance logging in. If you've never created an account before, you can create a new account by clicking here. And if you would like a user guide for parents, you can click right here. Once you get logged in, to view your child's results, you will see on the right-hand side a menu that looks like this. It will have all of your children, and it will show the different subject areas that they were tested in. You can click on these little arrows and it will drop down and you'll see um, different things including the results. And you will also see the open-ended items rescore request form is here on this menu. After you view your child's content area results, if you wish to see the scores that your child received on the open-ended items, you can click on the open-ended items rescore request form on the tab and it will open up. You'll see something that looks like this, a big square. It shows the different sessions that there were open-ended items in and boxes that will all initially be blue. If you have items that are blue, you can click on the item, the little rectangular box. The item will be highlighted in red to indicate that you have selected it to be rescored. Depending, depending on the specific test form that was administered to your child, some sessions will contain items and some will be blank. That is normal. You can deselect an item if you've already selected it to be rescored and you change your mind. You click on the red and it will become blue, which means that it is not selected to be rescored. If your child received full credit on an item, it will be in gray and that will not be selectable. The final open edit item scores will be reflected in the student results that are scheduled to be released in December of 2015. A request for a rescore may or may not result in a change to the content area scores. They may stay the same or they may increase if you request them to be rescored, but they will not go down. You can only request a rescore from November 9th to November 13th. So here's that rescore window. If you've lost your invitation code letter, please call 800 481 4769 or email support at ctv.com. The school does not have Additional copies of the invitation code letters, you will have to get that from CTV. Thank you for watching. If you would like some further information, there are several links on indiana.ctv.com for in -depth, more in-depth information, or you can call RCMS to get some additional support. Thanks, and have a great day.